And the whimper is may not be one of my personal favourite episodes of Frasier, but there are definitely some good moments in it, and I don't mind watching it. This is the 18th episode of the first season, directed by the brilliant James Burroughs, and this revolves around the Seabees, which are uh, radio awards, and Frasier and Ross have been nominated, and they're both really excited about this. And they toy with the idea of sending out gifts as a thank you for the nomination, but obviously that may seem like some kind of bribery. But they're not the only people with this kind of mindset. Other people are campaigning, helping to encourage more votes. And there's a great quote from Martin that I love because Martin tries to say it's not a good idea to send gifts from the Tiffany's catalogue. Personally, if I'd nominated somebody for a CB and they wanted to send me a Tiffany's gift, go for it. But Martin said, if I had to give somebody a gift to get an award, it's not worth having. Which I think is a pretty valid point. Success of any kind is great, but the best kind of success is where you feel like you've actually earned it. And there's definitely a moral dilemma here. Frazier's a bit more on the fence, but Roz is definitely not concerned about the moral aspect and just wants to win. And, you know, they're not exactly nominated frequently or anything, so I can really understand that. And a lot of the episode is actually set at the Seabees, and we have a lot of extras. I can't say for certain that this episode features the most number of extras, but I did notice that Kathy Nervosa was a lot more full than usual. And I imagine they just used a lot of the extras from the Seabees scene, um, or the Seabees scenes, to fill out Kathy Nervosa as well, because if you've got them on set on the day, you might as well. And I think that the set design for the award was great. Everybody was wearing brilliant costumes. It was very atmospheric. Really thoroughly enjoyed it. Also very unpredictable. And I thought Fletcher Gray was a really great character. He was really interesting. He's played by John McMartin. Uh, his mother is played by Maxine Elliott Hicks. And I really liked what they brought to the episode. One of my favourite moments, this may be a tiny spoiler for something funny that happens, but it doesn't spoil the narrative, but something funny that I really liked. Daphne was asking everybody to rub her feet and Niles comes into the room and she just looks at him and says, rub my feet. And without missing a beat, he says yes. And it was just, it was beautiful. The comedic timing was great. Really thoroughly enjoyed it. Daphne also had a really lovely, um, well, she said something lovely. I didn't write down the exact quote, but she pointed out that even though she's just hired help, Fraser always makes the effort to include her in family occasions. And I think it was a really great, great way of saying to the viewers that Daphne is as much a part of this family, even though she's just staff, if you like. And obviously she lives in the house, so she's definitely there all of the time. But I think, um, yeah, it was it was something that I thought was really, really sweet and, and really moving. And Daphne, of course, is a brilliant character. And you don't need to be related by blood to be important. It is a very good episode. It brings up some really interesting, you know, potential moral dilemmas or discussions, at least. Uh, if you have any opinions on that, whether you think giving gifts to say thank you for the nomination is bribery or a good gesture. Um, please let me know. Personally, I feel like I would err on the side of caution and not do that. But at the same time, a win is a win. <laughs> um, but yeah, definitely awards that are won through merit rather than bribery are the ones that are the best. A good episode, not a personal favourite, but it is uh, very well done, very well put together, uh, and one that I, I will never mind watching.